नमस्कार आप देख रहे हैं जनभावना टाइम्स और मैं हूं आपके साथ पारिचा वाणिज्य एवं उद्योग मंत्री पीयूष गोयल ने बुधवार को कहा कि पीएम गति शक्ति पहल परियोजनाओं के कार्यान्वयन के लिए लागत और समय सीमा को कम करने के अलावा बेहतर तरीके से बुनियादी ढांचा परियोजनाओं को बनाने में मदद करेंगे सरकार ने मल्टी मॉडल कनेक्टिविटी के लिए राष्ट्रीय मास्टर प्लान पीएम एम गति शक्ति को अक्टूबर 2021 में पेश किया था पीयूष गोयल ने भारतीय दूरसंचार नियामक प्राधिकरण यानी कि ट्राई के एक कार्यक्रम में कहा था कि पीएम एम गति शक्ति पहल प्रौद्योगिकी की आधारित परियोजनाओं को लागू करने के लिए लागत और समय को कम करने में सक्षम बनाती है ये बुनियादी ढांचे को बेहतर करने के साथ कुशल योजना बनाने में मददगार साबित होती है उन्होंने कहा कि पीएम गति शक्ति एक प्रौद्योगिकी आधारित योजना का साधन है जो आपको योजना बनाने परियोजनाओं की लागत घटाने और क्रियान्वयन की दिशा में समय सीमा को कम करने में आपकी सहायता करता है in the service of the nation and i compliment dr vagela and your entire team for the wonderful work that you have done to help the indian telecom industry grow in a very organized fashion and of course what better coincidence than to celebrate your 25 years and the nation is celebrating its amrit mahotsav the 75 years of our independence it's truly a matter of delight for me to be a part of your celebrations and to get an opportunity to talk about the prime minister's vision when he conceptualized the pm gati shakti national master plan initiative the journey of telecom in this country over the last eight years has been one of significant reform reform which has helped bring down the cost of using telecom facilities whether it's voice or data to levels unheard of unparalleled in the rest of the world reform to make life and business easier reform to save and protect issues or companies which are having issues reform to ensure customer gets choice but customer also gets world class services bill ban and corruption and prime ministers were forced to acknowledge that when the central government or any government sends 100 rupees to the poor they barely enjoy the benefit of 15 rupees with an 85% leakage through the value chain this country has transformed itself has revolutionized itself has reformed processes has used technology to bridge the gap and ensure zero leakages and the 100 rupees that goes to the poor reaches the poor as 100 rupees with no cost on the poor no leakages no middlemen no corruption in the system and to my mind for many of us all of us who are tax payers in this room who often used to wonder that when we pay such taxes is our money being put to good use who used to be concerned with this level of corruption over the years this is the single most happiness that our taxes today the taxes that you and i pay are being put to good use they are being used for the welfare of the poor as own contribution in the past in this field and i have no doubt in my mind that the work that the telecom sector has done in the last few years particularly as minister vaishnav said with regard to bridging the digital divide with regard to making telephony and telecom a part of everybody's day to day life an affordable and integral part of our lives i have no doubt that information and communication technologies along with digital connectivity which is growing at a rapid pace to reach every village in the country will be the foundation of india's growth story in the years to come it will have its own impact 
on almost every sector in the country and the new age digital connectivity very often based on wireless sometimes on wired and uh, linked technologies and off link also dependent in a big way with satellite technologies now aap se phir milte hain agle update mein tab tak dekhte rahiye jan bhavana times namaskar